hi hello welcome back to my channel this is currently 3 a.m 24th of june 24th of june is like a reminder of my first crush first crush's birthday and well it's about high time we forget about that i don't like even if i remember i don't think i'm going to wish him happy birthday today because i fucked up he fucked up like not in a bad way Get the gist. Anyway, as I'm looking beautiful this early midnight, I haven't slept yet. Why? Because I needed to complete Umbrella Academy. Like, who am I not to deprive myself of sleep if it means me completing this show? So, you guys, I've been up to a lot of things this June, May, and this year basically like i never thought i would be the busy kind but it turns out there's a busy side of me there's a busy side of me in this life you see my eyes moving back and forth you always know like it's hard to concentrate on myself and it's hard to concentrate on you guys so yeah wherever my eyes turn just kind of accept me and i'm trying to be fast so i can sleep because i want to start my routine again tomorrow i want to have a routine before i travel because i don't want to be that messy oh my god like i'm getting like i'm trying to get used to the timeline kind of messy situation i don't want to be that person you, like if you guys know me whoever knows me i like plan my head of time like sometimes i can go with the flow but some other times i'm just like yeah i need to plan ahead of time because i cannot be that person right now so yeah that's basically what's going to happen i have been up and down i've been trying to get my cast which is yet to come to me because i need to apply for my visa how do you expect me to live this life and you guys have noticed like i haven't been really consistent on youtube i need to stop saying that because that is a lazy stupid mindset okay so i haven't been really consistent on youtube and the routine i started february i've kind of gone down the drain since may because like me, I had a lot of stuff to do. I didn't have a lot of stuff to do. I need to say, I need to stop saying I had a lot of stuff to do. Because when I tried to embrace that I had a lot of stuff to do, then I will think that I am busy, which I'm actually not. If I have time to sleep and watch a movie, then I'm obviously not busy. Check it. So yeah, I've had, I also have a lot of edited videos, those from last year, those from early this year. And even yet to upload my final nyc video i'm waiting for the other coppers to get ready for their what do they call it for their passing out so maybe like this before they're passing out then i'll play it so it will look like i'm passing out with that batch meanwhile i'm not actually passing out with that batch which is still july next month um yeah so this morning i've already slept in the afternoon so i'm quite energized as you can see the energy is running high yeah so this morning like maybe around 5 or 5 30 I'm going to try to start working out again. You guys, the last time I went out on a run, that was probably April, end of April, before Easter. After Easter, things just went sideways. So I am going to try my best to get on a habit by ending of this month. I'll start working out again, but not with the aim to lose weight. Like, I've been having this body positivity feels recently i need you guys to like channel it channel it because like i don't think i felt this positive about my body like ever like recently like i'm i've been admiring everything from my shoulder to my yes i'm wearing a clothes in case there's any shower watching my channel i'm wearing a coat so mind your fucking business mind your business actually because i'm going to turn down the f word youtube should not attack me so yeah basically i need what was i saying yeah, I'm on a body, po body, body positivity, body positivity level. So basically, I need to keep on, I need to keep on and keep up with that energy. If you're hearing owls, that's because they don't know how to mind your business. And I'm talking, so they want to talk too. That's basically all. I need to get on a happy tracker, get my life back in check with God, with my physical activity. See that week, I finished it, but because of I haven't losing this hair, and I haven't installed it. I don't know if I should upload that video of this week. Or I should just go ahead to upload it on the mannequin. And then just edit the videos. Because like 
that video is taking like let's say 10 gig max or 10 gig minimum from my phone storage so i kind of need to like edit it so i'll have like maybe 5 gig and remaining 5 gig i'll have for other stuff because my life needs like this intro is getting long obviously but <laughs> I need to tell you where, I, where I've been. If you like, that to be 10 minutes. I need to tell you where I have been and how my life has been. So, yeah. um, Let's see. Around April, yeah, I went for Easter. May, I came back. I was doing a clothing challenge with my cousin. June, we had to upload the videos. And June, I started applying for new stuff. And I became a background actor and extra if you may call it such so yeah met met sore people celebrities <laughs> i came close to them you get me um since sasuke took a video with her sore um Amy, but i didn't want to disturb i don't want to disturb their privacy i think the only time i tried i did was when i saw a lot of people going to tony tones and i've already started taking a video of her with those people so i'm just like oh yeah why not just get a video yeah opportunities come but once so yeah and then um who else and to me and uh more like that so yeah you, you guys know like i'll soon travel so why not maximize this time i have and just like get on with life enjoy life enjoy nigeria while you still can even if i'm most likely coming back enjoy nigeria breathe in like make meet new people i'm not really open to making new friends but if there is like i can't say no to no because there is always that fit that still brings two people together even if you're not open to a friendship or relationship so i can't say no to no and i can't say never to never because anything can still happen and of course my colorful bedroom as always so welcome back to my life and yeah i missed you and i know you missed it too it was nice it was nice being away but it wasn't nice not Oh yeah, and I finally got monetized on YouTube. Like, I need to make a video separately talking about that. I need to make a video talking about that. I need to make a video talking about how I got rid of my acne. I need to make a video. I just need to make a video of a lot of things. But you know what is stopping me? I am stopping myself. I'm not even going to blame this on my phone storage again. Because my phone storage is not doing anything to me. I'm the one that is not even editing anything. I'm the one that is not even deleting stuff. I'm the one that is taking people's pictures. I'm not even deleting them. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> So I need to stop blaming my phone storage on my phone storage. It's my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. I need to move on with this life. Yeah. So you guys, good night. See you in two or three hours because I'm probably not going to sleep for long. Since I already said in the afternoon. And when I woke up, I kind of jumped out because I'm like, oh my God, did I sleep for this long? Like, is it already morning? Did I forget my evening routine? Did I forget to brush? Did I forget to do Duolingo? Did I forget? Like, a lot of things just came clouding when I woke up in the afternoon. Only to realize that it was just 6 p.m. in the af in the evening. So, yeah. um, Yeah, back to reality. I need to sleep now. I've already done nine minutes of old talk. So... I need to go. Good night. See you guys. And of course, like, uh, yeah, my dental appointment is still there. Not done yet, but soon and soon and soon and soon and soon. She's just a Um, So that's basically all my life recently. And so I'm doing a life update while trying to sleep, while trying to lie down in bed. Because what better time to introduce you guys than when I am hyperactive in the midnight and I have nothing at all. When I mean nothing at all to do. So I'll see you guys, um, see you in the morning when I'm probably jogging. Hopefully I take care along with me and hopefully my phone starts doesn't disappoint me. Yeah. My teeth is so high, you get. <laughs> That's on an oral on an oral routine. A hundred on an oral routine. Before I disturb my mommy, let me go and sleep. You guys, good night. See you in two or three hours. And if I see you in the morning when I'm already packing my load, just know that I was a very lazy person and I didn't have anything to do. Okay, bye. Good night. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up. Black is resonates the first time working out in a while. Take my time.
time Before I make my mind up And I do this like seven days out of the week And I I'm just going to wear my sunglasses on head off actually So yeah, see you outside I'm trying not to fill up with no storage So basically see you guys outside um, my voice is husky, obviously I just woke up. I shouldn't be explaining that to you because you're my cheese and you understand it. You understand the process basically. Um Where are my socks? Where are my motherfucking socks? Back on easy street. Hollywood ain't that good, it's going down like it's on a need to be. Even though now it's it's a bike and beautiful morning to be me. So, um Where's my energy? I told you guys I may wake up 5.30 but sorry it didn't work out but I woke up 6 um 6 a.m. 6 11 past 6 kind of kind of thing but I'm not going out until 6.50 just like 6.50 and this is when I'm just stepping out it's actually not my fault it is my fault but my tummy it's my tummy it's not it's not a personal fault of mine it's a tommy fault because like your baby girl was <sighs> my tummy has been acting up since day before yesterday yeah i started since day before yesterday, yesterday anyway i'm out now and let's go and work this shit out because yeah my face my face was um breaking out around four or three days ago but now it's quite it's, it's relieving itself it's actually relieving itself what that all this flies around me what kind of disrespect is this anyway let's get let's just get going i yeah let's get going it's okay with the story i feel like this is just an excuse for me not to work out early because like i'm trying to come back early because we're going to our uh, order we're going to the family house this morning one i've not packed two i pack in excess three let's just go and I grind so hard, I don't get much sleep. Don't think I'm crazy. I had to earn my stripes I so I don't have to work no nine. I feel like one of my motivations to start working out again is because, like, I saw my, you know, this, you know, this health check thing that's um that's Apple Apple kind of does that it kind of gives you the amount of steps you've walked. Well, recently I've been working like 200 and something steps a day. That's kind of money. That's to show you how inactive I have actually been. And before I was working 11,000 steps, 14,000, 16,000, but now I'm like 200 and something steps, 300 and something steps. It's just, it's just quite somehow for me. So. Pause, takes a break and she continues talking so I'm just trying to get my life back on crap back on check <laughs> you guys know this thing where <laughs> okay chill I just do you guys know this thing where like you try where like you are thinking of two words to use to like fill in a sentence but when you finally think of the two words, you kind of mix them together. That's why I said, I wanted to say check and I wanted to say track. So keep my life back in track, keep my life back in check. And I ended up saying, I ended up saying track, crack, whatever. Anyway, that's basically what I'm doing now because how can I walk 200 and something steps a day? That's very disappointing. Very, very disappointing. So, see y'all later. <laughs> But if you are looking for me, a bit at me for motivation, please turn your eyes away because don't look at me for any sort of motivation. You guys, I just went to work out, but I'm back because like my whole body is itching in irritation. I don't know how to explain. Like, see my palm, why is it red? Like, my hands are red. Like, I'm itching it. Like, my body is itching me so bad because I'm irritated for no fucking reason. And let me never talk about this sanitary pad. 
like it's itching the bloody hell out of me i'm like like sanitary pads cause irritation like what the fuck like my body is itching me Ugh. i went out with so much joy and confidence that i'll be through for the whole of today but it turns out that it's not going to happen because i'm in so much itch <laughs> i'm in so much itch like my body is my hand is a testimony my body is itching me like literally right now i'm going to go and wash my hair i don't even care if i'm on braids like i'm washing my scalp i'm scrubbing when i mean scrubbing my body i don't know maybe it's because i've not gone out in so long and then like you know this thing like when you run and your body starts like itching you because there is so much blood flow to that part of your body anyway i was running today oh my god there was a lot of blood flow to my bum bum but my bumble was itching me like like my glutes were itching the fuck out of me so i was just like uh no i can't i can't do this i'm not going to run so literally i just walked and then i was meant to walk around like five times but i only did four and a half because i was like fuck it i'm out of here like literally x i'm out i i'm not i'm not i'm not doing this to myself no one's going to do this to me no one punish me like my foot is itching my hands are itching my body is itching my face is itching my hair is itching where's this accent coming from but i like it you know anyway before i irritate you guys with the way i'm itching my body let me just x because uh, yeah so i told you the guys that i'm going to scrub my body right and then i come back I think I need to on my light. I'm tired of doing dark videos. Cause like, what do you expect me to do? I'll name this video dark, a dark vlog. So you guys, let me know what you think about this story, yeah? So you know I just came up back to, I just came out from working out. So yeah, I saw my mom sitting on Palo and then I was like, hmm, why is she watching news early in the morning? Like she actually does watch news early in the morning, but she doesn't sit down to watch the news. She's more in her room watching the news. So why is she in the parlor watching the news? So yeah, so this is story coming on. So there is this, I think, senator or a former lawmaker in Nigeria, yeah? His daughter has a kidney problem. And he came to Nigeria to seek help, yeah? And I think someone already gave him the consent that no problem, you can like fly me because I think his daughter is based in the UK or something. So don't worry, you can fly me abroad and take my kidney. Like, I'm going to donate my kidney to your daughter. That's what this guy said, that he's going to... Okay, shut up, no, let me not quote him. But yeah, he voluntarily said... He voluntarily, he was willing enough to follow the guy to the UK to give his kidney to the man's daughter. Oh yeah, now on getting to the UK, they got there, his kidney was not a match. And I'm pretty sure this guy has already been tested for his kidney in Nigeria because why would you fly someone all the way, waste all that money, and at the end of the day, the person's kidney is not the match. Is that that one? He already played a game back in Nigeria that he got the fake results, or I don't know what he would have done, but why would you do such a thing? Like, it's obviously something en route here that you already had planned before. Anyway, I told you guys to let me know what you think. I'm not meant to be giving you my thoughts. So. Oh yeah, now he got there when his um, organ was in a match and after everything, oh yeah, come and return back to Nigeria now, yeah, done. <laughs> what, what are you doing here? We've already, we've already confirmed what we wanted to confirm, like your organ is not a match. Oh yeah, now that's how he now went to the, I think the um, immigration or something or the visa people there i don't know he just went somewhere yeah? and then he was seeking asylum saying that oh his life is in danger that they came that they traveled that they brought him all the way from nigeria to the uk to harvest his organs da, 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 da. i know the way uk us like all these big countries they're always very quick to take actions like they don't even fucking care as long as someone has already reported like i don't think they seek I mean like they may give you trial runs but i don't think they seek like actual they don't seek an actual like proof but obviously for him to come all the way from nigeria to uk that's already enough proof i guess and then he's like his life is in danger only for these people to now arrest this man and his wife saying that they are organ harvesters and now i'm trying to think of how the daughter will feel right now in the hospital 
knowing that her parents are her parents were arrested because they tried to look for someone or a match for her to be honest yeah nigerians are very somehow nigerians are actually very rare somehow if you think about it not to even talk about the ones that are actually suffering like nigerians maybe me included <laughs> but nigerians in general like are very somehow they seek every opportunity every stinking opportunity whether at the at the loss of someone else or at the loss of their family i don't even know like they just seek every fucking opportunity to leave this country or to have a better life like why must you be like that why must you put other people in danger just so <laughs> to be honest yeah you never actually know the full story but from this story like no, I, Nigerians are just very somehow. I feel like, well, they are just very somehow. To be honest, like, why did you do that? Why did you do that? If you knew you were coming here to stay, then you'd have made it part of the deal. Maybe he should help you get a school education there, so that after a school education, you can stay. Like that can be part of the deal. Like why do you have to come all the way and then put another person's life in danger? Like there are smarter ways to do things than to go head on. Well, to be honest, I feel I want to bath. My body is itching me, like I said, but I can't find shampoo, so I think I'll use my bath wash to wash my hair. And I don't like doing that. I don't know where the shampoo is. Some of my shampoos are in Abuja. And then the one that I thought was in Lagos, I think it's not here, it's in the family house. Because, like, I, was, I stole my mommy's shampoo one time. And I don't know if I gave it back to her, but I think I did. Or I gave it back to my cousin, and my cousin left it in her room. We'll see, yeah. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. That's on me. If I come up and I fall off, that's on me. If I fall and I sell out, that's weak. That's why I take my time. Before I make my mind up. And I do this like seven days out of the week. And I grind so hard, I don't get much sleep. I'm going crazy. I had to. Hey guys, so I've done everything. I've washed my hair, I've had my bath, and yeah, I think I'm ready for the day. You people, there is something I don't understand. Do you think my, my skin was itching me to peel? Because this is how my hand is looking right now. Like it wants to flake off. I don't even know. Lucky, my body is still kind of itching me. Maybe because like I'm having PTSD. <laughs> it's too early to say I'm having PTSD, but maybe it's because I'm having PTSD that my body was itching me initially. So like part of it is still itching me. But we move. Like I'm still kind of feeling. It's just a bit. I feel like at this point it's a mental thing. I refuse to believe that my body is still itching me. After I did like an hour skincare routine. Basically, washed my hair, washed my body like two or three times and then i tried my hair and then like i just i've just done a lot of skincare routine today and i think it probably took me an hour or 45 minutes you guys i'm glowing let me show you my feet for the day it's not actually anything fancy it's more of um i don't want you to see my people my people's pictures so I'm just going to exit this frame and I'll see you at the staircase. Okay, so this is how I'm looking this morning. Um, never mind, let me just turn my camera this way. It's just way better. So, I'm looking something like this. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, it's beautiful, it's awesome, it's lovely. This purple, this purple top from Balogo Market is given actually, and I bought it for one thousand naira. <laughs> and my shoulders, ah, you guys, I, I told you I'm getting obsessed with my body. Like my body is banging. These shorts are, they're not, they're not the best, but I chose to wear shorts today because like they're not the best because. I don't I'm not a short person. I don't usually wear shorts and this is more of like an indoor short. But today I actually want to wear shorts out and then wear my big shirt over this and see how it will look. You get just kind of flex there here and there. So now I'm just going to watch um 
Netflix, my Jane Divergent series. This is like my second time watching that movie. Again, I just wanted to show you guys how fine I'm looking this morning. And I hope you are looking fine too in whatever hour you're watching this. My hair is actually still wet though. Let me show you. I'll use it to stay my top. Okay, look at that. Uh, not this one. This one has been thirsting. There's a new Mac there. Anyway, Shai, it's wet. That's basically the gist. Let me just go and watch a movie, to be honest. I'm just wasting your time and I'm wasting mine as well when I should be laying about and doing nothing. <laughs> You guys, until I get a proper stand, please bear with me and my not so Ooh. money heist Korea. Please, I will. Yes, more info. Yes, 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 yes. Please tell me all the episodes are out because I'm tired of watching half episode. If it's not out, I'll wait. Please, yes. Is it? Is it out? Everything? Ah, just episode six. No, now, hapa, 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 hapa. No, 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 no. And you are telling me, it's, oh, it's six episodes, not sixteen. I read sixteen episodes. Okay, we have a new movie today. I'm not watching Jane the Virgin again. I found something to waste my time. Okay, you guys, this is definitely what I'll be up to throughout the whole of today. Just in case, if you know me, I'm a Korean drama fan like their music forget it but their movie <laughs> well i'm all in so this is going to be me throughout the whole of today can you just freaking load is it because of i'm vlogging you don't want to load what kind of nonsense is this you know what you guys bye bye i'm not i'm not i'm not discussing with you again see you in the next clip i'm not discussing with you leave me alone i found a new movie to watch i found new love i'm leaving you wait first okay yes it has started bye So it's currently raining outside, but in here is apple, grapes, banana, and oats. Let me see if I'll pick up oats. Okay, yeah, these are oats. Yeah, and obviously my cereal. And let's eat. So this is the complete fit, my big shirt. And this, you guys, I'm eating egg because I didn't get any protein in my food. I will try and balance diet, okay? So, see you. Oh, yeah, and uh, this pink slippers is going to suffer in my hand because my gray slippers are spoiled. Let me just go and answer my mom, baby. Getting dull. You guys have stained my precious teeth. You guys, I think mom wants to trick me and dummy is around because I've called her two times and she's not picking my call. Her. Which is unlike her. We're going to find out today. For the first time, I said, if you don't pick my phone, it's going to, it's going to be official. Okay? You already, you have already thought about it too much. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. You're the one that will tell me. First floor door opening. Travel down. Why is it pimping? The video, they will not follow the flight. I think we were too, we were too much. Yeah, we were too much. But it's at 21. It's going down. We are big They were too much. I'm busy mommy powers. Who are you picking? Elevator. Because no, they use they probably use their legs and they f they work quite fast. Ah, goodness. Leave the house. Do what? Do
Do what? Do what? Do what? Do Can you see? What are you? No. Once beaten, twice shine. You cannot. <laughs> you cannot trick me again. I swear. You. you cannot trick me again. Like lie, lie. I'll never accept this. You can. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, uh -uh. money was being too specific. Cause uh, you can't try that for me. I'm an overthinker. Cause I was looking out for her. Cause I'm like, who do you? What are you? Why? <laughs> Like, why are you being so specific? Hey, uh, hold me. You cannot trick me. Say hi. Say hi. Because, like, mommy was like, we must leave this house 10 a.m. tomorrow. I'm like, must. I said, okay, maybe she wants to be traffic. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Right there. Ah, I want to go to International Airport. I said, hey, who are you I'm me that was playing my music. Mark them up for and I said, wait, wait, let me call them. Because this one mommy did during my birthday time. She was like, eh, hey, she wants to get something at the airport. That, that. Yeah. I said, she was going to, she said she was going to say she was going to take her. Yeah, and then she was like, that, eh, hey, that. When I call, when we were speaking yesterday and the day before yesterday, she like that. Did Dami tell me anything? I'm like, everything was just adding up in the car. I'm like, did Dami tell me anything? What was no, she you tell were speaking me? with her and I was asking for your discussion. You were asking for my discussion. <laughs> so everything was now adding up in the car. I'm like, you can't try this with me. My brain is very calculative. You can see, I not jumped. I was not, I was not hyper because I'm like, this is dumb, this is dumb. You can't. Anyway, buddy, I can't find it. You can't surprise me. What the hell? You said now what? I was not even expecting you to see at all. Uh uh. I want to keep. No call. Thank you. Thank Good to see you. <laughs> Yeah, but, you know. No, they got them more colors. Yeah. I don't know, you said you were not coming December. I'm not coming for one Shop when I'm doing. Well, I don't know what I want to get. That's why I want to make okay. wigs.